guys. Nutmeg is a six-year-old pity mix who we don't know much about her history. Um, there's some, she may have been a bait dog. And so when I asked her owner's number one goal for these private lessons, her owner looked at me and said, socialization. So what I'm doing is, you know, the first step for any dogs to be socialized is to get them to just be around each other and be calm and not have any issues. Um, people think socializing and they think playing and that is actually not what socialization is. For a dog to be properly socialized means that dog is able to just be around other dogs without causing issues. And when I say issues, I mean rough play, play when the other one doesn't want it, humping, mounting, um, and just causing problems, scuffles. So what I'm doing here is I have Hannibal on a tie back. He's also on an e-collar. He's also very, uh, very, very proficient in the place command. I also am trying to get this through to you based on the video, but it's something that I just feel in the room that the energy is calm. There's just no other way to describe it. I know based on Hannibal's feeling right now that he's not going to go after Nutmeg. And I have control of Nutmeg. I have her on a leash. So I'm in control of her. So I am socializing these two by allowing them to be in the same room together but not allowing them to interact. And that in itself is huge for socializing. And this is about 20 minutes later. They are just chilling out, very relaxed. This is the concept of place. So this literally is the first step to socializing a dog that is questionable, that has caused problems in the past, has leash reactivity. Um, her owner has not let her be around any other dogs. She's scared of what's gonna happen. So if they keep exposing her like this, this is the first step.